So it's a, a writing system like an alphabet. It's also they have a symbolic value to each of the uh, characters in, in the in the futhark, the alphabet, and they're also used for divination. And uh, yeah, that, that's pretty much their primary uses. There, there could be some others. There's bind runes, there's gold ore, and probably some other stuff there as well. So yep. yeah, what the runes are, uh, the symbol themselves are a visual representation of a fundamental frequency of the cosmos. Okay, wow, yeah. Which when you when you look at that, you can see, oh, okay, this is why the the Norse culture and the and heathenry has such this focus on words. All right. Yeah. No, I, I hear you. Yeah, the, the oral tradition, the whole thing, the storytelling, the myths and all this. Yeah. And I I, I think that's a big point missed. Um by a lot of people is that that's that's what they're actually representing so when you're um when you're tuning in through divination you're you're tapping into that vibration remembering all 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 things all energy always exists there there is no everything secular Think of it like uh, in one as you can think of it like a web, or even like a ripple in a pond. So it's it's the ripple is touching itself always in all places. Okay, yeah. Um, <laughs> just processing that. That's um, yeah. That's that's really good stuff. Being an alphabet, and they they represent a, a phonetic sound. And combining phonetic sounds, you have words. And there is a, a big part of the, the heathen culture is on the spoken word. Mm. Look at, look at the, the focus on um, the skulls and, and poetry. And, you know, it's, it was very important the way you spoke and what you said and how you said it. And there was a reason for that. And that's because they were the language they were speaking in was it's, it's runes. This is why I use um, the younger Futhark because we still have the old Norse language. It's still it's right there. You know we have Icelandic, which is still so close. 